Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, Dr. Bandar Hajar, President of the Islamic Development Bank, Dr. Hayat Sindi, Advisor to the President, Honorable Guest uh, and Participant. On behalf of the World Intellectual Property Organization and its Director General, I'm pleased and very privileged to be here addressing to you to this very important event on intellectual property for commercializing science, technology, and innovation uh, for sustainable development. Innovation uh, is part of our life. Without innovation, your phone will not be smart. Just imagine that you will have no GPS, you will have no HD video, you would have no color screen, no sound, no, uh, no, no, maybe no WhatsApp, no Skype conference call. Just imagine that. How would we live without that? We have been addicted to that. And I'm sure while I'm talking to you, some of you may even use the smartphone. So this is the purpose of innovation. It's not that we are, because we don't find so much patent application that we are behind the others. It's just that we don't have yet the means to understand and to implement that. And I'm sure that with these meetings, and you are here, the decision makers of 53 countries of Islamic Development Bank, you are here, uh, the, the, the people who understand the value of intellectual property and innovation, you, and, you, and you are the one who can help to, to make this shift ahead with innovation project. And it is also important to keep in mind Two important uh, tweet. In 2015, two important agreements were signed. The first one was the climate change, which was signed in uh, the climate change agreement within the framework of the United Nations, which was signed in Paris uh, 2015 to reduce the emission of carbon. And the second one is this, uh, the, the General Assembly's decision to support the 17 sustainable development goals within the framework of the United Nations. And the recommendation nine is related to innovation. And also the recommendation 17 is related to networking. And this is the purpose, again, of this meeting. I would like to, to quote some very inspiring it's very inspiring um, uh, quote uh, because now IDB and uh, the, um, the member state have a lead to bring uh, innovation into the G DNA of the region. So let me quote another, uh, another very first one. My passion for intellectual property comes from my understanding that IP is a key uh, is a key unlocker for sustainable prosperity and human society. This was said by Alexander Gerbeck, who is the president of Ecubes Arcola, uh, a UK company, but who is trying to promote, you know, the creation of hydrogen cars, you know, with no, uh, with no emission of carbon at all. The second one is a famous one from um, Madiba, our, one of the greatest leader in the world who said, it always seems impossible until it is done. And the one from President Jokowi from Indonesia, when we see challenges, I see opportunities. And uh, the one from the Prime Minister of the Netherlands, he said, innovation is, 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 is not a list of projects. It's a mindset, it is a must. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you are representing IDB member state, and uh, it, it, as we, I said initially in the, in the beginning of my speech, you know, innovation is part of our daily life and will be, will be the future, our future. And it is up to you to take the challenge to meet this, to, to, be, to, to join the innovative process so that uh, we can meet them successfully together. So I thank you for your attention and I wish you inspiring and fruitful debate. Thank you.